This case has left people confused for over 20 years because why would a nine-year-old girl leave her home in the middle of the night during a rainstorm? The case I'm discussing is the disappearance of Asia Degree. Her story starts in Shelby, North Carolina. Nine-year-old Asia lives with her dad, Harold, her mom, Aquila, and her 10-year-old brother, O'Brien. By all accounts, the Degree family is a pretty normal family. They go to church. They spend a lot of time with friends from church and their family. This day in particular, February 13th, 2000, was a Sunday, and it was a very uneventful day for the Degree family. They went to church. They ate lunch at their aunt's house, and then Aquila, Aisha, and O'Brien went home while Harold went to go work at his second job. Typically, when Aquila would get home with the kids, she would bathe them and they would get ready for bed, but this night, it was a little bit different because there was a crash and it caused the power to go out in the home, keeping the kids from getting their nightly bath. So instead of taking a bath, Aisha and O'Brien went off to the room they shared around 8 p.m. to go to bed. Most sources say that Harold gets home around 12.30 a.m. He goes to check on Aisha and O'Brien in their room and the kids are asleep, so he goes off to get ready for bed and wind down by watching some TV. Around 2.30 a.m., Harold is ready to settle in for the night, so he checks on Aisha and O'Brien one last time. Again, nothing out of the ordinary. The kids are asleep, so he goes off to bed. Sometime in the early morning hours, O'Brien wakes up and he sees Aisha standing in the middle of the room. It's believed she went to the bathroom, now she's back, and she gets in bed. Shortly after this, O'Brien hears Aisha's bed squeak, but he doesn't turn around to check on Aisha because he thinks she's just moving around in her bed. 5.45 a.m. rolls around, Iquilla's alarm goes off, and she heads to Aisha and O'Brien's room because she needs to get them up a few minutes earlier to get their bath in they didn't get the night before. As Aquila opens the door, she sees O'Brien sleeping in his bed as usual, but as she turns her attention over to Aisha's bed, she notices she is not there. Aquila goes into panic mode and she starts searching this house up and down. Aisha is nowhere to be found, so Aquila runs to her room, throws on some clothes, and she wakes up Harold. Together, Aquila and Harold go outside. They start searching the cars and calling family members to see 